creating a chain. The chain function lets you create the rhythm track for an entire song by specifying a rhythm style for each measure. Press the Chain Playlist button. You can create up to 30 banks of chains. By the way, when in Chain Playlist, Recorder, or Player mode, this button is now Play Pause, and this button is now Stop Reset. These two buttons are now Previous and Next. For example, you select the chain you want using the Previous and Next buttons. C1 through C8 are the demo chains, so I'm going to select C9. It's probably empty with 8 beat 1 assigned to the first measure by default. But just in case there's already a chain registered, I'm going to erase it by holding down Delete until the button lights, then pressing OK. To create a chain, hold down the Chain Playlist button until it blinks. Basically, you select what rhythm style you want and the tempo then specifically what variation, fill, etc. you want for each measure. I'm going to use the 16 beat 3 rhythm style and set the tempo to 130. I want measure 1 to have variation A's fill 1. This shows me I'm on measure 1 and M1 is flashing showing it's on the first measure of the first 8 measures. Press OK now it automatically moves to measure 2, displayed on the screen, and M2 is now flashing. For measure 2, I want variation A, so I'll keep it as it is and press OK. Now I'm on measure 3. I can move forward and back through the measures in the chain using these buttons. I want fill 2 on measure 5. then Variation B on Measure 6, then on Measure 9, the ending. Notice that Measure 9 is displayed on the screen, and M1 is flashing, meaning it's the first measure of the next group of eight measures. Press OK. If you want to cancel a rhythm style on a particular measure of the chain, use these buttons to go to that measure, then you would press Cancel to delete it. Once you're done, press the Chain Playlist button. It stops flashing. And all the settings you did plus the tempo are saved. To hear the newly created chain from the first measure, press Play.